Morning everyone, and it's actually morning this time, usually I get lazy to do any recording until like noon or after that, afternoon. <laughs> but uh, my dad made me some wontons, so he steams them, like he makes them handmade and then he steams them and I love having them with my soup sauce. So that's what I'll be doing this morning. Uh, it's not much of a breakfast, but uh, it does taste great and I enjoy it. So right now I'm just watching some videos, hanging out. Um, I don't know if there's something different with the dressing this time uh, that my nurse changed it, but I'm feeling a little bit more discomfort, like I was having trouble sleeping last night. So I don't know what it is. But hopefully it passes and I feel okay and then maybe me and Natalie can go out and do some stuff. Um, you know, it's just not that... You get a little bit bored being home all the time, right? So you want to go out and have some fun, and plus I want to get some nice content for you guys. So, we'll see how the day turns out. It's supposed to be nice and cool right now. There's a nice breeze coming in, so I don't even have the air conditioning running for once. So, yeah. Ooh, exciting. Hey guys, we're outside again. Um, we're up here in Vaughn. We're, watching, we're gonna watch The Secret Life of Pets. I felt like getting out of the house, but uh, I know it's weird going to go watch movies and exactly doing too much outside of the house. But uh, Natalie's, Natalie's gone to our den, our den, our den, I don't know how to pronounce it, our dens, to pick up something and I'm just chilling in the car because no need for unnecessary moving, there's nothing that I'm going to want to see there anyways. Um, but she should be coming back and then we're going to head out over to the movie theater. Hey Nat. There she is. We'll be going For the movie, movie, Natalie got a little hungry so she's getting a veggie burger from Hero Burger. Looks pretty decent. Yum yum. I just want some onion rings, nothing big, I'm not that hungry. And they have these awesome little dip and squeeze ketchups. Look at this, like it's, you can dip it or if you cut it off at the top you can squeeze out like a normal package but this is a nice size and very convenient, you know what I mean? But this should be a standard. I want I want more of those. That's been Alright, so we just finished watching Pets the movie. I'm sure Natalie has a lot to say about it. I, I don't even know what to say. It was just like amazing. It was such a good movie. Well it's what you would so expect. Cute. And it was really well done and the cuteness factor of all the pets was captured. But right now we're heading over to um to Vaughn Mills, just, just to, you know, roll around a little bit, I guess. I'm gonna roll around, Natalie's gonna walk. But uh, I feel like being outside a bit more, so that's what we're doing. I accidentally made Natalie go south instead of north from the movie theater, so this is my bad. Um, but traffic's not too, too bad, so we should be okay. And we'll film a little bit when we get there. So everyone, we are at... Okay, well, I might get like, this right here but nothing above it I don't think. So guys we are at Vaughn Mills and uh, now he's pushing me around in my wheelchair and I went to the washroom for the first time like as a wheelchair or handicapped person and I gotta say it was an interesting experience like I wasn't sure how to use the washroom exactly so I like backed myself into the wheelchair uh, stall and then I used the poles to like stand myself up and maneuver around but yeah, you know, like, don't really want to touch too many things because it's not the most sanitary, but, like, I have no other choice, you know what I mean? Well, it's really, like, you truly don't understand how difficult the world is until you can't do something. <laughs> yeah, obviously. Like, That's... when I took that disability class, it was mm. like, when I opened my eyes, like, I was finally able to see, like, people, and it's not just people who have mobility issues, it's like mm. seeing, hearing, anything. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like yeah. Like the world is not built for you. It's difficult, yeah, I know. Well, you know, it's something you get to adapt to and it's not gonna be forever that I'm gonna like be like this. Once our prosthetic comes in it'll be a different story, but thankfully I have Natalie to help me. Right? So we're gonna shop around. I don't wanna get too many people in it because people don't like to be photographed or video video taped. So um We'll catch up with you maybe when we find an interesting store. H&M and I gotta say shopping in this state is actually kind of easy because now I don't have to carry things in my arms you know just put it on myself and I wheel about just trying to get some shorts 
be the uh, some good shorts here because I don't really want to wear pants. It's hot and it's just uh, easier on my leg. And I don't really care to hide that. It's no point. People were saying that I should wear pants so it looks normal. I don't really care. So yeah, we'll, we'll keep shopping. We'll show you the haul later. So we're going down Weston Road right now. We stopped off, get a dollar drink, and we also had some fries in which I was feeding Natalie while she was driving, you know, she's got to keep her hands on the wheel, but she can't keep her hands off the fries. So, it's a good... Yo, Mandarin, let's go. Yo, all you can eat. Natalie's going to go get french fries. <laughs> and at, pasta. At an all you can eat Chinese place. And so, all you can eat pizza, pasta, don't forget. I'm not. Pizza, pasta, and french fries. I think, don't they even have onion rings? They do, yeah. For dinner they do. All you can eat. So pretty much what happened was they closed the um, entrance to the highway where we were because we were getting McDonald's and so it was causing a whole ton of traffic and so we just decided to go down Weston using like a whole roundabout way. We could also turn left here and go on the highway but you know. It's just really just, annoying because it didn't have any sign saying that it was closed now. It said closed nightly, but, but it didn't at say the exit, it was at the exit. It wasn't saying like and, before. And the other way was open, mm -hmm. and that said closed nightly too. Yeah. So I don't know. Right now, it was really annoying. We'll just take this extra, this new, different route. You got to do what you got to do. Whatever, scenic. You know this. It is a nice to look around, it's better than the highway I guess, but the highway is just a bit faster. But what can you do? You guys can take a look at some of the scenery. 99% of the time, everything works out. Yeah. Actually, this guy that came home depot today was like trying to get his friend to like relax and he was like, everything's gonna work out, don't worry. And I was like, my uncle always says 99% of the time, everything <laughs> works out. There you go. Look it's at like you. the famous line now. Contributing. You're contributing. You're helping them. What well, a cute kid you are. It's true because a lot of them are like working while they're at the depot, right? Like they're getting yeah. stuff for work. And we're finally at some form of a home. Right now I'm just relaxing. I'm getting these weird like flash pains. I don't know how to describe it. But I'm just trying to relax. And we're going to watch a little bit of Murdoch in Natalie's place before she takes me home. Yeah, that's it. Nah, much else to update about it. Ah, see, I don't know what that is. But I think everyone should get something like this. It's Cody. Um, so essentially, you can download streaming add-ons to stream TV shows and movies online. It's really, really good. Of course, saves you money. Um, there's a lot of things that you can't get on Netflix that you might want to get on here like it doesn't even have to be a um like a new show like even the older shows that you want to watch and netflix doesn't have right to rights to you can get it on this and if you have a pc a mac an android device they can all run cody and it takes just about a minute or two minutes to get it set up it's really great i might even do a video on it what's up guys I am back at home after quite a long day. A lot of stuff was done today. Uh, watched Secret Life of Pets. Then went out and went to the mall. And I got a few shorts. Actually, you know what? I can show them to you, I think. Let's get over to the bags. I know it's cool outside today, but uh, it's humid in my room. So I want to get rid of all the humidity first before I go out and open the window. I need more space. There you go. So, went to H&M. I wasn't expecting much, but I wanted to just take a look inside. So I found these shorts. Alright. Seven bucks. These shorts. Also seven bucks. These are like sports shorts, but also 
nice comfy ones and thin. And then these ones, 10 bucks, 24 bucks for three pairs of shorts. I like it, I'm gonna use them, it's gonna be hot. And uh, I don't really care about hiding my stump, uh, it's not really uh, an importance to me, I don't care what people think really. Um, just want to be comfortable and I'd rather have it exposed instead of try to like hide it but then it look funny with pants so like I'll wear pants in the winter time or fall but right now it's hot I'm just trying to keep cool so thanks again for tuning in today you guys hope I'm giving a better idea of what it's like to go through something like this something like an amputation alongside my chemo and cancer and stuff like that but right now we're focusing on the on the um what's it called on the amputation and getting around without two feet it is a little bit difficult but it's definitely doable um, but yeah things are coming along nicely so I'll catch you guys tomorrow and thanks again so I'm here at uh, Dollar Tree it's just a dollar store at uh, Crossroads but Natalie is picking up stuff to put on my wheelchair you know like um, reflective tape and stuff like that I don't know why but sure let her do what she wants and I'm hanging out in the electronic section nothing to write home about but you know they have like a dollar cases for iPhones over there you know dollar cords and stuff you know I think that's pretty cool you know they're, they're nothing impressive but you know a dollar for a cord you just throw it away if it's broken you won't be too sad instead of paying like Twenty dollars for a cord, and look, even one of those bedazzled. <laughs> Looking that cool. Dollar twenty-five. The those badass gems on there must be worth like forty-five bucks. You find your reflective tape.